Hello friends. If you watched the series named The Umbrella Academy, in the third season you must have come across the term the grandfather paradox, which causes the Kugel blitz and the end of the world. The grandfather paradox is a hypothetical logical problem that could arise if a being travels back to a particular time in the past. The term comes from the concept that a person travels back to a time before their grandfather had children and assassinates him. This could make their own birth impossible. Grandfather paradox dives into this contradiction and problem. The grandfather paradox or consistency paradox happens when the past is manipulated in any way, thus resulting in a contradiction. If a time traveler went back in time and assassinated their grandfather in his childhood, it could result in a situation where the time traveler's parent is not being born at all. In that weird case, the time traveler also wouldn't be born at all. So who killed the grandfather in the first place? If this scenario is plausible, the traveler would not be able to kill the grandfather. There is no predicted outcome to this. Consistency paradoxes happen whenever changing the past is viable. A probable solution is that the time travelers can do or indulge in any event that did happen but cannot be involved in anything that did not happen. When we do or involve something that did not occur results in a contradiction. The other possible solution is that each alteration of the past results in an alternative past with its own individual different outcomes. Quantum mechanics do point to a multiverse with infinite histories. New histories or timelines emanate out from time altered junctions. It goes like this. When the time traveler kills the grandfather at that point, a new timeline or history sprouts where the grandfather dies young and all his offspring do not ever exist. On the other hand, the history or timeline of the time traveler continues to exist independently on another paradigm. Both timelines or histories exist as complete separate paradigms. In this concept, each time a person manipulates the past, a new independent history or timeline is created. Time loops are the other hypothetical outcomes of such worlds. Now let's discuss the practicality of the grandfather paradox. The most accepted version of time travel is by using a wormhole. Wormholes are space-time holes. Among the most bizarre consequences of general relativity, wormholes are typically represented as shortcuts between two points in space. The theoretical physicist Stephen Hawking proposed that wormholes could probably loop back to a point in the past. This could be very much possible as time and space are inseparable according to the special theory of relativity. Anything that can influence space should influence time also. Such a coupling is called the closed time-like curve. Even if the laws of physics allow backward time travel, there are many obstacles that might hinder the possibility of the grandfather paradox. Hawking proposed two possible workarounds to deal with this paradox. According to the consistent histories model, the entire spectrum of time is strictly predetermined. In this model, we can only travel back to a particular point in the past only if we had already been to the exact point in our own history. In this model, we can interact with the past but we cannot alter it. So the grandfather paradox has zero chance to arise. The second approach is based on quantum mechanics where an event has several probable outcomes with varied likelihoods of occurring. There is a many worlds interpretation of reality in the quantum realm where all the various outcomes occur in different and independent parallel timelines. In this scenario, the grandfather paradox can be resolved if the time traveler begins out in a timeline where the grandfather survived long enough to have offspring and then after traveling back and killing the grandfather, this will continue along a parallel timeline the time traveler will never be born. If you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For more videos like this, hit the subscribe button and remember to click on the notification bell. Also be sure to check out our other videos as well. Thank you for watching.